This file is currently 27.4 megabytes, and I want to compress it using 7-zip. After compression, we should get a low file size, so we can easily upload or send it to someone online without consuming much data. So, let me show you how to do that. If you don't already have 7-zip installed on your PC, you want to go to your browser and search for 7-zip. The first link should take you to the 7-zip download page. We have some download links here. So you want to click on the version for your PC. My PC is 64-bit, so I'm going to click download right here. And from there, you can install the 7-zip app. Now, when I go back to the desktop, right-click on the folder we want to compress, and we should now see this option called 7-zip. Hover on it, and then click on Add to Archive. On the archive name, you can rename it to whatever you like, but I will leave it as it is. For the archive format, I will go with 7z, and you can choose zip or any other format you like, but 7z is the best compression method as it compresses files better. Under Dictionary, if you have a powerful PC, you can choose up to 1024 megabytes as it is better for compression, but if not, go with 32 megabytes. You can also set a password if you want. Then I will click on OK. That should begin compressing our file. This could take a long time, depending on how large your file is. The files I'm compressing are MP3 files, which are hard to compress, but other types of files should compress better. All right, the compression is complete, and we have a new 7z file on our desktop. When I hover over the new file, you can see it compressed a bit. But again, that's because the files are MP3. MP3 and MP4 files are hard to compress using 7-zip. After all, when they are retrieved, they should give the same file size, but other types of files should work fine. Also, the folder is not large. If you are doing this for a large file, you should see a highly compressed file. So, that's it. If you find the video helpful, click the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.